Hey there, in this video, we are going to be looking at a practice question for the Certified Kubernetes Administrator. This is me Sagar, let's get into it. So the question we are going to look today is how to perform a version upgrade on a Kubernetes cluster using kubeadm and make sure you pay attention to the version number in the question asked. So this question is part of the CKA curriculum. As you might have already known, you are allowed to have one tab open for the Kubernetes documentation. So the key to passing the Kubernetes exam is to match your time carefully and, and to know the right keywords to search for each question. So the question we have is to upgrade the Kubernetes cluster. Let's search for upgrade kubeadm. Right, and again, make sure you pay extra attention for the version number in the exam. I'm going to click the first result. Here we have how to upgrade different versions. So I currently have version 1.17 uh, installed on my cluster. I'll be upgrading it to 1.18.5. Everything you need to upgrade the QADM cluster is present in the documentation. Let's scroll down. Let me pull up my terminal. So first we upgrade the master node. Uh, we don't need to run these commands because we already know the version we want to upgrade to. It's 1.18.5. So we're gonna go to upgrading control plane nodes. Make sure you run these commands as root user. And replace the version here with the version in the question. It's 1.18.5. Copy the next command. Paste the next command. Let's install the QBDM package. Change the version. Now where it has the expected version, here we see 18.5. Now let's train the control plane node. Let's get the name of the control plane. kubectl get nodes. So here I have my control plane node. kubectl drawing with the flag ignore daemon sets. See the, so the node is trying. Let's run kubeadm upgrade plan. So it says now you can apply upgrade by executing the following command. Make sure you specify the version required here. This now the cluster has been upgraded to 1.18.5. Now let's uncorden the control plane node. So next we need to upgrade the kubectl and kubelet of the master node. Copy these commands and replace the version. Copy the next command. Replace the versions here as well. Now 
make sure you run these my for the instruction correct now let's update the token nodes i'm going to do both of these parallelly refresh the version now for the other node copy this second command paste it paste it copy the next command for the cube radium replace the version Keep the gel dry. We did no demon sets flag. Make sure you train the other worker node as well. So, so both the worker nodes are trained. And now to upgrade the cube ADM, let's run the following command. I'll do the same for the other other node. Here yeah, it says the upgrade is successful. And let's upgrade the cube and cube CTL. Copy these two commands and replace the values. Eight point five. The same for the cubelet as well. Let's do the same for the other node. With the next command, let's do the same here. Let's do the same here. Run these two commands to restart the cubelet. Do the same for the other node. Now let's uncord in the nodes. Let's go to a master node. So now both our nodes are schedulable and let's run, let's get the status of the nodes. So as you can see the cluster is now running on version 1.8.5. So that's it for this video. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button and make sure you subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching.